Welcome back to the 25th Ward. Uh, I think I figured it out what makes the recording size spike. It's the video... well, not the video, the background behind all the pictures and portraits set to the music. Now, when it's just a repeating pattern, it must be easy to compress for the video codex. But when it's set to music, it's much more complicated, requires more data. Alright, let's get to Matchmaker, which, as we know now, covers an organization that kills people so that their bad behavior does not... Um, does not annoy other people into killing people? Yeah. This is all really silly, so let's go to the lunar orbit. Kinda interesting where this is going to be timeline-wise, because... How was that? You mind translating it for us? So, as I was saying, weird timeline-wise, because the two episodes of Correctness cover the same time period. So, is this story going to advance somewhere? Is someone going up the stairs? Wait, that... that was... He looks younger. Is this a flashback? Yes, it looks like a flashback. This is where his obsession with Mont Blanc is coming from. Okay, and nice for the game to explain. Are we going to? take over the world. We can't disappear just because the government said so. Oh yes, you can. So, is it going to be like a drama? Okay, we're going to be trapped in this flashback for this entire episode. You now, chances are pretty high that it is the case. That would help fix the timeline issues and make everything align. Talking. Aha. Busted. Your ass specifically. Okay, that's going to straighten him up. Not really. Uh, 
All right, so we'll have an inner monologue now. Still snowing outside? No. Wait, I can't look. Oh, maybe... Maybe, maybe that looking with no reply was progression. Yes, this is progression. We're getting more dots. Hmm. Okay, more dots. some heated debate in the back. Going where? Ooh, scene transition. We're not going to be stuck in the same room forever. Also, the background is not synced to the music, so... Yeah, this should be a small video. The hell is this lady? How drunk is she? Right. Okay, let's can we move? Okay, let's let's have a some gameplay. Sitting and drinking. Less little, presumably. Wait, what? Is he... oh. Wait, 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 wait. Did they... Did they mix up who's saying that line? You didn't pick a fight with me. They totally gave Tsuki the line Ishiki was supposed to say. Okay, let's play a game. Let's end every sentence with a huh. Or ha ha ha. Oh, okay, so this is before the 25th Ward Project. Yeah? Okay, who is tossing you this day? Hmm... Why is the crest important?
Okay, conveniently. Ishiki-san has stopped the snow, so we can go. And we don't have to spend the entire evening in this bar drinking. Okay, so we are back in the past, but we are... We have mobile phones, this is not completely retro. So she didn't say dot dot dot, she thought dot dot dot, going by the brackets. I wonder if this is the same bar owner... Wait, no, that, that was a different bar in, in Tokyo's story. The Ghost Lady. What are you doing here? Or is it a different day? Okay, they're going to send the new guy away. Right? Yes. What kind of favor? Uh -huh. Go to a faraway warehouse and just just go there. Oh, a designer bag. That's uh, that's the, the the weird magician dude. So he's on his way there now. Oh. Mm. So do they know one another? Okay, are they setting up some kind of trap? I mean, obviously they are setting some kind of trap, but... What kind? What's the point? Ooh, we get to walk! Let's go away! 
look away. This is what they mean when they say it's way, way, way out there. Yeah, see, the warehouse is way, way, way out back. I see a code lock. Can I check my inventory? No. Right, what's the code? Ah. Aha, uh -huh. so is he going to ruin the trap somehow by eating Mont Blanc? Have you forgotten it too? Ah, yes. Okay. Wait. Fifty nine October. A date isn't a number. Oh, come on, it is a number. Okay, is it going to be as straightforward as usual pseudo puzzles? Let's try 5910. Yep, as straightforward as usual. Predictable. Okay, let's see what kind of trap is awaiting Tsuki. You only notice just now. Ooh! So that's what Haiti used to look like. Wait, that, that was a different name. I missed it. Apparently, yes. Ah. Oh. Okay, I think we should open the bag and see what's... What's the situation? The box. The bag. Ah. No. Ah, this is a trap. I see. So 
so that guy back in the syndicate sold everyone out? What box? It was a it was a bag. Shock full of shit. Oh, a, a bag of shit. Oh, sugar. The real thing, real sugar. Yes, granulated. Yeah. It's totally sugar, checks out. Very addictive. Okay, so that's the story of how Suki ended up in the big house for dealing sugar. No, is he telling this story to someone? Yes. I see. Is that him in a flashback? What? Okay, can we start the chapter for real now? That's a very uncomfortable driving position, you know. For one, you can't see the road. Yeah? Not behind the wheel. Oh, this is... I see, this is happening right, I guess, minutes after... After the battle of the abandoned hotel. So... How much did they give you for sugar? That's your natural state. Okay, so they decided to start dealing sugar because their money was money was becoming tight. They decided to branch out into confectionaries. And it didn't go well.
Daigo Natsu. Oh, it's um okay, we know that guy. He joined a military unit. Wait, was he part of the what's it called? Special Force, whatever it's called. You know the guys who got killed by Yes, Republic. Who got massacred by you know. I'm sorry, wh why do the special forces of the police force recruit a guy who is a minor player in a minor syndicate? Why? Oh, did you forget the name of the main character from the previous game? Oh no. You didn't. Shit. Okay, yes. Stop rubbing it in. Next you're going to bring Big Dig back. Okay, so this is how he survived. He was hurt. The incident in the woods. Yes. Oh, this guy. Yeah, so are you going to tell us yours? Because this, this seems to be one of those episodes where everyone is telling... Telling their next story. Yes, yeah, so you can sleep, just keep driving asleep. Oh, he's a Sutter driving. Alright, is anything going to happen now, or will there be more backstory? Are we going to hear the backstory of the Chief, how he founded this absolutely ridiculously silly organization?
Okay, are we going to go back to our old mates and shoot them? Oh, finally. Tokyo. Yes. Clearly, killing Tokyo is not going to take much time because, well... Because we seem to be halfway through the episode. Well, he probably sorts his trash wrong. Oh, he's snooping around, whatever. There's more, and you cut away. Oh, this is Tokyo's boat, right? Two introductions. Great. And they're not even sitting, just standing on a stakeout. Uh, yeah, whatever. He's just left. Aren't you supposed to, like... Well, yeah, people usually don't buy groceries instantly. Aren't you supposed to, like, kill him? Why are you... Why are you just watching him? Yes. Okay, yes, you're putting Osato on the boat. Ah. That's a very important clarification. <laughs> 